Hey guys, welcome to Inside Waverley Park. My name is Mark Pittnett. Uh, we've got an away trip this week down in Tasmania to play the Saints, so we're going to ask a few of the boys who the worst teammates to room with when they're away and why. So, Sis, we're wondering who is the worst teammate to room with on away trips? Uh, oh, I wouldn't know. I room by myself, but I'd have to say maybe someone like Shawnee or something, because you never get to sleep. You'll just keep telling bedtime stories, and he's, he's good at telling stories. You usually go for about half an hour. Fair. So, so, so the fact that you sleep by yourself, could that be other people requesting not to be with you? Oh. Like you could be the worst. You could be the worst teammate from I don't know what everyone else is going to say yet. Yeah, I haven't looked. At, I haven't looked at it that way, but um, um, I'd imagine it would probably be one of Sicily because he doesn't know when to be quiet and. Uh, luckily enough, I get a room by myself, um, but I would request you, because of your honky, you snore too much. That's a fair point, fair. Yeah, I'm just going to go with Sicily. We did, yeah. I did just ask Sis before you, and he did say he usually sleeps by himself. We thought it might have been a, people requesting not to be with him. Yeah, I think there's a few snorers in the group. Um, I, know, I know Chip Frawley's got a pretty bad snore on him, yeah. so that's, he's probably one who'd be pretty unpopular as well. I can pick that. You can definitely pick that. Okay, nice. <laughs> uh, I don't know, I only room with Isaac Smith and we've sorted each other out so we know uh, how not to annoy each other. So we're here with our resident, uh, one of our resident Irishmen, Connor Nash. Uh, we just want to know who is the most annoying teammate to sleep with, the worst teammate to sleep with on an away trip and why? Uh, well I haven't been away much but I'd probably say James Sisley. Um, yeah, just, I wouldn't say he'd be great, be a bit smelly. He's a bit smelly around the club. Pretty, pretty immature, pretty childish. Yeah, he's a bit immature, yeah. He's just, he's just, I wouldn't say he'd be good at all. James Sicily, he's just so immature, you know. And he, it's been a bit of a recurring theme. A few it? people are saying they request not to be with him. Well, one, he makes a lot of noises in his sleep, like he talks to himself and snores and forgets to breathe and does all weird, weird stuff, so probably Sis. I've heard Sis is uh, a bit messy, so um, I think he snores as well, so. Pretty, yeah. pretty smelly as well is another theme we keep having. Uh, yeah, I've heard that, I've heard that. I don't know myself, but I've heard it, so. Yeah. Uh, well, a lot of us at the moment make room by ourselves. Um, <laughs> he just got that in the face. Um, I, uh, I used to room with Jordy Lewis for the last 10, 10, 11 years, and he and I had a really good routine, but in terms of boys you wouldn't want to room with, uh, I'll say Sisterly. Um, a lot of these young boys that aren't really independent, they think that uh, mum still washes their clothes and whatnot. I think these boys that just aren't independent, mate, I wouldn't want to be a part of. So you probably fit into that bracket as well. Yeah, mum washes my clothes See, still. There so. you go. Enough said.